Okay, so I already record, so we will start again. Okay, this is what we already covered yesterday. Uh, we already looked into the overview, unsigned number and signed number. And this equation, I already give you the example. If you still uh, didn't understand, you can check uh, our previous class video and also the video that I provided. Uh, the specific one is the video under uh, conversion. Because on the conversion, you're going to see how you convert and etc on this equation you're going to apply this one so uh i guess in numbering system video also you are looking at the byte the kilobyte megabyte and gigabyte and as i already mentioned uh this one is very important because you will always do the conversions uh as the question given and yesterday we look into on sign extension what we learn we learn two which is lbs and mbs for the mbs is very important because mbs will always uh the one that shows you whether it is positive number or negative number so if it it beats you're going to calculate one, two, three. <laughs> Amboi, bual sa masa dalam kelas saya lepas tu terbuka mikrofon sendiri ya. Eh. Nanti video ni bila di record siapa yang cakap tu akan muncul gambar kan. Ah nanti saya tengok eh siapa yang bercakap tu. Next class ah um, boleh juga eh bercakap eh buat borak dengan kawan ke saya nak dengar juga. So this one you can see that there is 8 bit. So everything over here is 8 bit and you can see that this is MBS. Yesterday I already show you the left one is MBS, the right one is uh, LBS. So you can see this is positive number. So normally for Two in binary, you're going to have one zero. But because of this is add bit, you need to have add bit in front also. So you need to add zero, 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 and so on until you get the most uh, signed bit, which is MBS, is on your left side. And if you convert it into the 16 bit, you're going to have like this, which is everything that you add in front will be zero because it is a positive number. And after that, we look into negative number, which is negative two. So if you see over here, this is two, but when you add negative in front you need to add one so never, normally one represent as negative and zero will be represent as positive so everything in front here uh are showing that it's going to be a negative number basically this is the one that uh, be the key for you to see okay this is negative number but the rest because there is no value in between you need to put also negative same goes to when you convert it into uh, 16 bit so you need to add everything one in front so you need to be careful uh, because in question they're going to inform you uh, how many bit for uh, the question because if you are given just numbering without mentioning what uh, how many bits that the number are uh, showing so you're going to get very confused because you don't have uh, the idea what is basically in front here and 
Of course, normally when you convert it directly, you're going to get a positive number, right? Because uh, we just directly convert it from our equation that's given over here. So that's why uh, I guess it's quite confused if the question is not provided you with the bit uh, binary, how many? So this is the sign that we already looked into, sign extension. And same goes to this type of number. We already look into it. And what we're going to look is on this part, which is under sign number, the magnitude and also the complement. This complement video, uh, you can check the one complement and two complement uh, at uh, the video that I provided in our e-learning. But of course, we're going to look into uh, in this class also. Okay, yesterday also, we already looked into the LSB uh, and also MSB. So LSB is the less sign bit. And MSB is the more signs bit. So LSB is at the most right. And LSB. MSB is the most left. So this is M and less is at your right. Drench number can represent. So there is a question. If you look back over here at our beginning class, there is a question if you notice. What is the largest number that can be represent in a computer world? So this is basically on computer worlds. But if the largest numbers also being depend on how many bits, then easy for you to understand because you can have the range number equation. How are you going to calculate it? Uh, you're going to see that you are going to uh, have the range from 0 to 2 to the power of 32. This is the bit uh, basically uh, for you that maybe you are given, okay, to 32 bit, what, uh, what is the range of number? So you're going to put to the power of uh, 32 minus one. Why minus one? Because if you check over here, although you have 32 by a bit number, the Biggest or MSB is at the bit, 30, uh, bit 31. Means that you need to minus 1 because our numbering are starting from 0. So we need to include 0. When If let's say we start at 1, then we're going to get 32. But because we start at 0, one, two, three, and so on. That's why we need two minus one. So this is the equation for a range number. Is it okay? So if there is uh, any question, you can just interrupt me and ask me uh, directly. So under sign numbers also, as you can see, there is two divide. Uh, where is it? Okay. You can see that we can divide it into two, which is magnitude and also complement. So now we look into the magnitude. So the conversion is this one I already mentioned, which is the leftmost is the uh, MBS. And the remind bit is the number. So let's take a look at the example. Yesterday, I asked you to do. So maybe... Uh, after this, I'm going to pick someone. Uh, please try to explain the example. I guess maybe example two or three. So over here, uh, this one is very easy. Uh, I also already show you, but maybe I will uh, show step by step. Okay, one plus one, it will be one zero. It's not going to be 10. One plus one equal to one zero this also um, i already provide in the previous uh, previous video 
if you check there is a table so there is a table uh, in the video that showing you what is happening if let's say zero plus zero you're going to get zero if zero plus one you're going to get one if one plus zero you're going to get one and etc so one plus one you're going to get one zero so one zero this is okay one zero means that uh you are going to write this one as the sum this is the sum and this is the carry so that's why you will put the carry above so this is the carry and after that you're going to see there is another one the table is five so one plus one is this one and another one is one plus one plus one so one plus one plus one is not going to be three so what happened is going to be one one so that's why i asked you to uh, watch the video because the video are also provided with the table and you can also refresh your mind basically all and everything you already learned in your digital logic so one plus one plus one you're going to get your sum one and the carry as one that's why your sum is one and your carry is one over here then you have one plus one will be uh one zero and then you plus one you're going to get one zero also so your sum is zero and your carry is one after that you're going to have also one plus one is going to be one zero right so you get you get some zero and your carry is one one plus one, uh, zero uh, plus zero you will get one without a carry like this right without a carry and you have one one and then this one is one if you calculate it one two three four five six seven so this is the seven and you are dealing with at bit binary that's why at the mbs you need to show it as a zero in front for all like 79 the M, uh, msp will be zero for the 35 it's going to be zero also so zero plus zero you will get a zero so showing that you have positive one one four so this one is very easy but of course when you are dealing with positive and negative later on you're going to have a problem because normally you're going to have the overflow yesterday also we already looked into it but i asked you to do to do the example right so now i'm going to ask someone to show me how you did uh i will try to memorize you back that the sign bit only for sign so we cannot carry into it otherwise the result will transcatted as the mbs bit overflow so it's going to give the incorrect sum this is what happened uh if the overflow we did not chart this just it and we just take it so uh, and we will going to carry it into our sign it will cause the incorrect sum because the sum will be a sum of two positive number but it's going to be a negative because you're going to get one so here there is an example example two over here you can see you're going to add two binary number one two three four five six seven eight normally i'm going to calculate it although it's going to give me eight bit i just want to reconfirm okay this is the msp and i know this is positive number 
and then after that i have another one one two three four five six seven eight and i check over here okay this is my msb this is positive number also normally when i add positive and positive i'm going to get positive also right but yeah we look into that after this we have this uh you can use your scientific calculator to check this number what is this when you convert it from binary to decimal and it's very good for you to try it manually using the equation so you will uh, like learn and exercise yourself not going to depend on your calculator and over here you can see uh, that when you convert to decimal you're going to get positive 79 and this one is positive 99 so when you add it basically you're going to get more than 100 right but later on you will see that your answer is wrong oh wait you can see okay one plus one is going to get one zero this one we already look one zero 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 is a sum and one is the carry and then after that one 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 you get one 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 plus zero uh, one plus one you're going to get one zero this is your sum this is your carry and then one one you have one zero also and also another one is uh, what happened here? One, one, uh, okay, sorry. This one is one plus zero plus zero, you get one. And then you have also uh, over here one. And before that, you can see before you go to the eight bit, this one is at seven bit. Seven. Okay. Over here, you can see that you have one plus one. If you have one plus one, you're going to get one zero. One zero, zero will be a sum. And of course, another one will be your carry. But when you bring this carry in front, you're going to get one over here, which means that your MBS will be negative. But how to do? This is the one that showing the error so error result answer should be 178 so what happened over here uh because of this uh okay i want to pick someone to explain the example three because we have adding negative and positive the sum result will be same as the large magnitude after this okay so this is the problem happen when we are dealing with uh sign magnitude uh with the carry forward inside over here so last carry overflow is this just so you need to discharge it you cannot uh bring the carry in front because if you bring you're going to get negative number so please try to do it and try to convert but over here when you have zero zero one one uh zero zero one one zero zero one zero so what the answer should be so you will get 50 so it's totally going to be uh different that is why there is a problem on our signing magnitude and adding the sign number so uh i guess i'm going to ask someone to explain example three because i asked you to do all the example isn't it where is my example three so i pick someone who come late as usual Wait. Wait, I check the... Okay, the one who come let is Sergo. <laughs> Sergo.
Yes, Doctor. You can hear me. Macam naik kapal terbang ni datang Malaysia ni. Sorry, Doctor. Okay, so go. Yes, Doctor. Okay, we are currently doing the example. So, okay. I already showed the example one and example two. I want you to share and teach others on example three. Is it okay? That's okay. Okay, so you can uh, share your screen. Uh. Where I can find the slide. What again? Uh, you need to Where? you need to click uh, bottom right present now. Yeah, okay. Where uh, I found the slide for a question. For uh, example. Click. Yeah, you need to present now. Uh, the slide is in e-learning. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dia tak jumpa ke? <laughs> Rasanya dia tak download slide lagi kot. Uh, okay, okay. Let me, let me, let me. Uh, how I'm going to present but you need to draw something right. Maybe you go to the e-learning. We already give you the notes. Notes. Module 2, module 2. Yeah, yeah. Mana ni? Yes, doctor. Yes. My my computer is very slow. Yeah. Okay. Uh, maybe I will pass to someone second lead. Wait, I check. Um, uh, where is it? Yeah. Where? Where? I will do screenshot. Because uh, there is no here, <laughs> so I will just pick. Uh, I remember who's come late. Mm. Muhammad Hazik, where are you? Hazik, tak buka kamera. Hazik. Hello. Where's your webcam? Uh, my dad pinjam for his meeting. Handphone tak ada? Ada. Ha, kenapa tak buka pakai handphone? Okay, sekarang ni kena present juga ni. Yeah, which uh, example three, right? Example three, yes. Okay, we are. How do I present? How do I... Now you are using handphone or you are using laptop? I'm using my, my computer. Ha, then oh. can present. Wait ah. Uh. Hmm. Next time, when I pick someone, lepas tu you tak ready, hujung-hujung uh, class you kena denda eh, you kena nyanyi eh. Because you are uh, taking our time just waiting for you. 
So kena lah bayar ganti rugi tu. Kena hiburkan kami. Mana Haziq ni? Sego pun tak lagi. Okay. Suaranya tak ada. Yeah. Eh. 19. Kata my, wait, wait, wait. My, my writing is very bad. Because I'm less, I'm less in the music my mouse. Eh. Example mana ni? Eh, doing example three, right? Mana example two? Example three Tambah dua puluh ke? Yang Example three Okay, oh my bad, wait Oops <laughs> Wait, doctor. Wait, in the in the example, right? Hmm? Why is it why is it after you plus uh the first number is negative? The sign bit is one. I don't really wait. Why is it the first number? Positive. Do I have to wait? Yeah. Tak habis lagi tu. Tu ni ni buat example ke tidak ni? Apa dia? Buat example ke tidak ni? Uh, wait. Apa dia Dr? Buat ke tidak? Semalam kan saya suruh buat buat example. Oh uh, ada orang lambat lagi ni ha. Apa uh. tak? Suruh dia. <laughs> eh Danda nak pandai tukar. Wait, so suruh one zero plus one. This one will become two because it will be forward. Carry over it. Be one. Eh, mana datang dua ni? Ya Allah. Zero. No wait. So okay. One. Okay. Okay. Explain teacher. One. Explain sir. One. Number three, one, 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 one become zero, two zero zero, two zero, two zero zero. Wait, is this correct? <laughs> I think it's nice. One zero. Because the first number is negative, so it's sign bit one. The second number is you need to you need, you need to explain to us. You are the teacher now. No, because the first number is a negative number, so the sign no. bit is one. The second number Wait. is positive, so the sign mm. bit zero. Because so because it's this. One zero, one zero, one zero one. So because that is, because I subtract that. Okay. So zero will be the same as I'm watching the YouTube. Zero. 
Siapa lagi yang tak try example ni kan? Ha, jangan yeah, buat doctor. sekarang. I think I think it's all I got for now. I'm sorry. What? I think it's all I got. I think the, wait, am I missing something? Yes, you missing something. Zero. One. Oh wait, no, this is zero. One, one zero. Now, I I have a question, sir. I have a question, sir. Uh, how how you get two over there? What is it? Because how this one, this one we borrow, this one we borrow, borrow from, borrow from here, right? Because one plus one is zero. This one we borrow from here. That's why it becomes two. Is it that? I think that's I ask, from I, my understanding. I ask you, sir. I ask you because I don't understand why it should be two. Where should I borrow? Should I borrow or should I plus? I'm very confused. This is adding or subtraction? Because in, I think, yeah. yeah. Okay, doctor. Okay, so actually, right in the example that is given in your slide, right, it says two there. I don't, even I I thought it's one, honestly, because in the in the in your slide it says it's two, so I don't really understand why is it two there. In your <laughs> slide, because I have your slide, it says it's two there. Yes. Uh, uh, so, so I I don't really understand why it's two. Then I got called. So I was the, gonna ask you. Okay, so the problem is uh, when you didn't understand. Uh, ask me first because if you start with one flow, one step, uh, if you move without understanding the basic, so it's going to be problem, right? Yes. So maybe uh, we can try someone that maybe can explain to us first. Uh, thank you, Hazik. Okay. Uh, the one who just joining us. Who's the name? Abdul Kasim. Abdul Kasim. Abdul Kasim. Yes, Doctor, I'm here. Okay, uh, we are currently at example three. Yesterday, I asked all of you to try. Can you help us uh, explain the example three? Uh, I cannot see the screen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, let me share my screen, but you need to explain, okay? Mm, wait. Saya nak cari eh siapa yang tak buat eh, lepas tu tak tanya soalan ya. Eh. Okay. We are in the middle of example three. Basically, yesterday I asked all of you to try and if you have problem, please ask me. But I think no one asked me before our next class, which is today. Uh, we cannot move on if you still did, on, uh, did not understand. So what happened here? Is it telling you the problem or I don't know? Uh, I'm not sure, but uh, for the the third part, which the is uh, uh, two, I think it has to be one. Why it's two? Because uh, we borrow only one, right? We borrow only one. Yes. Yeah, so this is the only problem. That's the result uh, is uh, not correct. So over here also, uh, 
that showing that this one is coming up, uh, becoming two because it's wrong, isn't it? That's yeah. just you. Okay, thank you. Uh, you think it's wrong? So who else? Hmm. Siapa eh? Kejap, I stop dulu because I want to see Wait, 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 wait Aduh, it's low nya I cannot see Your face What happened? Uh, doctor, you close your mic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah, okay, because I was uh, being kicked by this Google Meet. Okay, I call for Sangawi. 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 Can you explain what is basically happened in our example three? Uh, I didn't quite understand. Uh, you are second semester student? Uh, yeah, I, I have to go through that. Right? Do yeah. you still remember what happened in our digital logic class? Uh, I have to go through that again. <laughs> okay, what is basically happened here? I think this uh, method is totally new for you because there is uh, let me share the screen first okay can you see now not yet not yet hmm, uh, my internet quite slow okay wait can can you see? Yes, doctor. Okay. So over here, uh, basically if you check this and this, you were given at bit. So first teacher, uh, who's Hazik? Ah? Forgot. First teacher are showing only seven bit. And then how I need to yes. Okay. Uh, first teacher only showing us seven bit without showing us this eight digit which is our MSP. So this one is new method. I guess you did not learn it before. But still, if you are given this kind of question, I guess you already already learned it in your digital logic subject. So should be there is no problem at all for you. Although you did not understand this, you can apply it the method uh, from our DL subject, which is supposed when you change it like this, right? You already change it to the sign numbers. So you were supposed to be uh, having the adding process. 
over here it shows you the a different method when you are uh, land from in front uh, or the biggest bit so you're going to have one two if let's say until here you're going to be three until here you're going to be have four and so on but uh, suppose it's not going to be something like that because normally in binary you only have zero one zero one so it uh, to be make uh, to make it easy that's why uh, this is the problem in a sign magnitude uh, numbering system when you're dealing with the sign that going to be a problem later on that's why it's mentioned over here there is a problem one and there is a problem two but uh, you can see the problem one is for example two and this one for example three but if you are given this kind of question, you just change uh, 19 to be a sign magnitude number, you're going to get like this one. With this is as a sign. So you're going to use the adding process later on. But because of this, that's why after this, you're going to learn also on first complement second complement this is showing over here that this second example having a problem because you're going to get error in result same goes to this kind of question that if let's say you have here as zero let's say you have zero over here should be giving to have three or it's going to be two so over here so you need to know whether it is over here is one or what because it's going to be a problem later on if you have this kind of problem so that's why it's come out to have problem one and problem two problem one uh, and your example two problem two and the example three problem one you can see you having the overflow so you're going to get incorrect sum so problem two you have the complicated to define the large magnitude to subtract negative number which one you need to borrow from uh, the biggest bit number this is what happened so that's why all of this problem you come up with the um, solution which is come from the first complement, second complement, and so on. But I guess most of you didn't try the example. If you have problem with all the example, you need to ask me directly be before our next session class. Because if let's say I did not explain it bad, so I straightly jump to first complement, and then after that second complement. So you might confused because you didn't have strong understanding yet why you need to learn all of this is it okay or not so next time when i ask you to do the example please do or rather than i will ask you in question then you cannot give uh, you cannot be a good teacher there is it okay okay or not okay yes, <laughs> Okay, so uh, we're going to move to our first complement. So over here in our first complement or uh, one complement, I also already give you and provide you with the video. It's 10 uh, hours. You can try to watch it back. Uh, try to memorize it back, what happened. Uh, although uh, basically you are going to be fully like uh, doing the assembly program and so on in our COA but there is also a test that going to ask you in a numbering number uh, in numbering system which is the question we ask you to add to subtract and so on on the numbering so under uh, one complements over here uh, in complement system, negative value are represented by different between number at its best. So yesterday, I just go through right one by one. So uh, it's not going to be detailed yesterday. So 
that's why today we're going to look into it. And in our numbering system, a negative value is given by different between absolute value of number and one less than it best. What is the meaning by this? Mm, my battery. Okay, in binary system, this give us one complement. It's amount to little more than flipping the bits of binary number. What is the meaning of this? Okay, we're going to check it. So using one complement, add bit. So same goes to your friend, the first so Hafiz, isn't it? Uh, what is basically happened? Uh, he didn't calculate. That's why as I mentioned, I always see what is the bit given in the question. If add, so I will calculate. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then I know, okay, this is at na bit number and I'm going to see, okay, nine. So at my MBS, I'm going to put zero first. So this is what happens if I'm the student. Uh, the first example from Sir ha Hafiz, uh, he only show us until seven. So that's why also it's going to be different in your answer. And another one is 23. I will take it this first. Okay, it is 23 and I see there is a negative in front of this 23. So that's why I will put this as one at my MBS. So that's why I put one over here. So my 23, uh, basically, let me check, uh, zero, two, two, four, eight, 64. So until here, isn't it? So over here, this one is one, two, four, sorry, eight. After this, 16. Eh? To the power of four, I forgot already. 32, okay. Is it something like this? Uh, one, two, four, eight, 16. After eight is what? To the power of four? I think it's 16. It is 16. 16. After that, 32 and then 64, right? Yeah. Yeah. 64 and 1 to 1 8. To okay. So over here, you can see that this one is uh, 0, 0, 0. This one is 8. Should be 8. Uh, over here, 32. 32 minus... How come it's going to be 20 here over here? 0, 0, 0, it's going to be 8. Also, 1, 2, 2, 3. Mm. Okay, uh, let me see it one by one. Over here, you can see we need to change first. Okay, sorry, the first compliment. This is 9. Positive. So 9 over here, this one is 8. Uh, let me clear. This one is 8 plus uh, 1. You're going to get 9. And because of this, this is 9. After that, it's all positive. And you need to check your MBS. Your MBS will be 0 because it is positive. So this is okay. And it's going to be confused when you have negative number, which is sign number. Before you do the adding process and what happened to your digital logic, before you do adding process, you're going to convert it to your first complement. So 23. Uh, without, 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 without uh, negative, 23. You're going to get uh, one zero, isn't it? Wait, wait, let me calculate first. Uh, 16 plus, 16 plus seven. So 16 plus seven, one. 
32. So until 16 only. So I put here one. And then after that, if I pull, I, if I eat over here, no, it's already more than that. So over here, 16 plus 8 will be 22, isn't it? No. So this one is 0. So this one is will be 1, 1, 1. 16 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1, it will be 23. Correct, right? 23 hexadecimal, which, uh, uh, decimal, Best 10, you convert it into binary, you will get 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, binary. You can use your calculator. I don't have scientific calculator. If you convert it directly, 23, without the magnitude in front, you will get 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. Correct, right? So this one. Because you're going to uh, add it with positive number and this is negative number, you're going to convert it to be first complement. So how are you going to do the first complement? If you go back and refresh your memory for, for, for digital logic subject, you're going to convert it if it is zero. Uh, if it's zero, 1, it's going to convert to 1, 1, 1, and basically going to have the adding process and so on after this first complement for your second complement. So over here, you will going to see you convert it to be 0. This one also 0, this one also 0. If 0 is going to be convert to 1, if 1 is going to be convert to 0, 0 going to convert to 1, 0 to going to convert 1, and then you're going to convert 1, and you will put it this first complement over here. That's why you will get this is your first complement. You will get like this situation for adding. So from here, you will add it. Then when you add 1 plus 0, you will get 1. 0 plus 0, you will get 0. 0 plus 0, you will get 0. 1 plus 1, you will get 1, 0. If 1, 0, sum is 0 and your carry will be 1. So 1 plus 0, 1, 1 plus 0, 1. So you will get 1. And then 0 plus 1, 1, 0 plus 1, 1, 0 plus 1 will be 1. So no need to do anything after that. It's going to directly show you this is negative 14. Uh, this one is 1, 2, 4, 5, 8. Uh, this one is 16. So this one is negative 14 if you convert it back uh, because this one is in the first complement. So this is how you basically uh, do in the adding process for uh, add bit binary when you have positive number and a negative number or unsigned number. The last carry is zero so we are done. This one is the carry because there is no more carry at all over here. Uh, there is another example. I'll show you another example so we can look one by one. We just change. The value is similar. So we just change the magnitude of negative sign between these two numbers. So before this, when you have uh, 9, you can see that over here, 9 is 1, 0, 0, 1. Same goes to what happened here. You have 1001. But you need to change it because when you are adding it, you cannot use 
the example three you cannot use example two because you're going to have problem later on that's why you need to have the first compliments uh how you're going to do adding process for sign number so you need to change and convert it to the first compliment first how you just change one to be zero zero to be one zero to be one one to be zero and then zero to be one zero to be one zero to be one zero to be one it's very easy for you to remember it uh so this first compliment is quite easy rather than after this you're going to uh uh what learn on second compliment and so on so from here you will take this part and you will bring it to here so this is negative nine although you see uh, what is number you want to convert is or oh, no no needs because this is should be the first complement so when you have the first complement you just add using uh, the normal adding process you can see over here one plus zero it will be one and then you can see over here uh, one plus zero and uh, one plus one you're going to have zero and then you have a carry one 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 you will be one one so uh, to be make easy you check the last video i provide you with the table also and if you don't want to check the video you can go to uh, your last notes uh, from our dl subject there is a lot of uh, examples and also tables for this adding process one you're going to get one 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 going to get one zero and etc until the last you get going to see that it's going to be zero and one but you need to ignore the last because you can see that we will ignore uh, the carry up sound later on you will check it then after that you will get this is basically your answer but uh to the sum you're going to change it to uh best 10 this one uh the answer over here similar so you're going to see that you need to plus one back to convert it back to the exact answer uh for decimal so you will get uh zero one 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 yeah. and hmm. siapa cakap ni <laughs> siapa yang cakap tadi tiba-tiba tiba-tiba ya <laughs> nanti ya saya record ni kan bila saya dah dapat kan saya akan nampak tahu muka siapa yang bercakap tu dah dua kali dah ni tiba-tiba ya tiba-tiba ya Gaduh dengan girlfriend ke apa? <laughs> ya, tengah kelas ni. Percayalah agaknya macam tu kan. <laughs> Mesti dia punya girlfriend cakap, eh kelas kan sampai pukul 10. Ha, ni dah lebih ni. Ya, tengah kelas ni. <laughs> I think so, I think dia punya sebab dia kata dia faham pun. Ha, kita husnuzon lah. <laughs> oh, positif. Positif betul lah. <laughs> okay, okay. So uh, let me finish first. <laughs> After this, I'm going to see who who is the one that cakap iya tu. Tak nak mengaku pula tu. Uh, mana tadi? Okay. So with, uh, with first compliment addition, the carry bit is carry around and adding to the sum. So that's why because you cannot just let uh everything in over here this is going to be put it below here so over here you can see that after it's going to have carry zero you can also do similar adding over here but nothing will be happen right so that's why when you add over here you will get this one and this should be positive 14 decimal so that's why what happened over here is basically from above hmm. nanti tiba-tiba datang dari mana turunnya dia ini untuk you tengok eh tak faham lah ha. so this is coming from here 
So uh, next class, uh, I think I'm not going to wait for our next class because basically uh, this all we already learned. So later on, uh, I'm going to provide you with video for second complement, the example, please do it. Uh, so in our next class, I'm going to just forward the first complement and I'm going to directly to go to the fixed number but I will provide you with the video for second complement and in our next class before we move to our next subtopic uh, where is it okay before we need move to our fixed number aromatic I'm going to pick someone uh, to teach in our class maybe for the example but maybe also not example but a review question so you need to teach us not ask me what happened is it correct or not is it okay or not so i guess uh wait oh why cannot cannot go out okay So, uh, first of all, I'm going to do the second compliment video and I will share with you. And you can also refer back to the video that I already provided in our e-learning. And please do all the example. I guess I'm lagging, right? Please do all the example and also the review question that provided in the example. So if you having problem, please do ask me before our next class. So our next class, I'm going to jump directly to our next uh, new subtopic. But before I start with new subtopic, I'm going to pick someone to teach in the class. Uh, I just going to randomly pick any question that I want. So if you cannot explain, uh, then at the end, you're going to have trouble because I'm going to pick someone later on. So as a promise, as promise, uh, let me see. Uh, wait, uh, I try to open to check who's the lead person. But I guess uh, he's Abdul Qasim. Mm, it's okay because uh, he's a foreign student. So next class, uh, who cannot do or cannot explain well, you're going to sing for us. Mm, so today, uh, it's lucky for you, Hafiz. Uh, I just let it go. So thank you for all. I guess there is no question. Right? So we're going to end our class by today. So be, please be prepared. You have about one week to go to do all the example and to do all the review question. Then you're going to explain in class. Uh, ming minggu depan mungkin perempuan lah pula kan? Uh, asyik lelaki je kena. Perempuan ni senyap je pula tu dalam kelas. So maybe we will pick. Sokong. Uh, <laughs> so cool. Laju je. Tapi saya nak cari juga siapa yang bercakap tadi yang dia yeah tu. Ha, maybe dia boleh ceritalah apa yang jadi sebenarnya. Cerita sebenarnya apa yang berlaku kan. Sharing is caring. Okay. Uh, is there any question? No question. So, <laughs> okay. Thank you. Ha. Doctor, I didn't uh, do scan uh, for uh, attendance. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, you already WhatsApp me, right? I already reply. So later on, I will contact you also. What? Sego, did you yeah, WhatsApp yeah. me? No, right? The one yeah. that WhatsApp me is Libya. Is it you? No, no. The... No, right? Uh, sure. Uh, even you are uh, the one now. Yes. Uh, you are the one. No, 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 no. I'm talking to Sego first. Sego, you are from S E uh, S C S R, isn't it? Yes. 
Ah okay. Uh, after this, after I try to finish with the e-learning, I will direct put e-learning e-learning or maybe I will directly give you the QR code. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Bye bye. Thank you, doctor. Thank you, doctor. Bye bye, doctor. Thank you, doctor. Bye, doctor. Have a nice lunch, doctor. Lunch? I am not even taking breakfast yet. <laughs> it's okay. We take brunch. <laughs> brunch, yes. Bye. Bye. Yes. Doctor, it's me, Arifu. Yeah. Why? Yeah. What happened? Yeah, definitely. I think I think you can enroll me. Uh, like uh, you can just add me this e-learning section. Then I you don't. Hey, me. you still you still cannot enter. No, no. Which which section you are? Nine. Nine S E C R. Actually, uh, yeah, the S E C R. S E C R. Yeah, but I can see uh, my previous code, which is SCSR, but uh, I have to know uh, which is uh, in your SECR. Hey, which basically you need to check whether you are SECR or you are SCSR. Yeah, ma'am, ma I am SCSR. SCSR 2033, SCSR. Okay, so the e-learning is not yet putting anything right? Yeah, no, not yet. Okay, uh, same goes to Sergo. So, uh, I tried to uh, complete it by today. Okay, sure. Okay, okay, okay. Bye. 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 Thank you, Doctor. Bye, okay.